Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my spring wardrobe essentials for 2022. You guys know I love doing seasonal capsule wardrobe videos. I feel like I honestly nailed it with this haul, you guys. This is by far my favorite wardrobe essentials video haul that I've ever done since I started this channel. This is just based on my personal style and things that I really love wearing and using. And don't feel like you have to purchase like every single thing. You don't even have to purchase any of it. You can just use this video as a guide, as a reference um, to build your seasonal seasonal capsule wardrobe for the spring and summertime. But as always, if you are interested in anything I share today, I always have everything linked down below if you wanted to check anything out. My personal size measurements are down there as well for your reference. Also in this video, all I'm sharing is outerwear, tops, and denim jeans. I have two other videos that are coming up right after this video where I'm sharing spring dresses and then another video all about spring shoes. So I decided to make it into three separate videos rather than all one video because it would have been way too Long. and if you're new hit that subscribe button I would love to have you back again I'm publishing lots of spring content this month for you guys and also give this video a big thumbs up if you do enjoy it and let's go ahead and hop right in so let's start off with outerwear okay so for outerwear this season I decided to do a little bit more casual because that just kind of fits my lifestyle a lot better and I already have a lot of more dressy outerwear pieces so I decided to do a little bit more casual for this season first one being is this jacket from mango so it's a really nice cream color, has a little bit of an oversized fit to it, but it does have structure to it. The back is longer, which I really like, and you can wear this multiple ways. So you can wear open layer like a cami underneath, um, you can cinch in the waist here if you want to define your waist more or you can leave it like open So that way it's a more straight down fit just depending on what fit you like You can kind of customize it to your body and to what you're feeling like wearing that day and This color I feel like is fantastic for the springtime. It's really light fresh the quality of this is fantastic Next up is one of my favorite outerwear pieces that I purchased is this olive green utility jacket so I've already shared this on my Instagram, I think a couple times. I love it so much. It's more lightweight compared to the mango one that I just shared in that cream color. I also love this light olive color. I feel like it's just so fresh and bright for the springtime. I also like the fit of it. I got this in the smallest size it comes in, which is a size small. Has a bit of an oversized fit to it. This also comes with a belt as well. So you can wear it multiple ways. You can wear it open without the belt, open with the belt and kind of tight in the back can have more of hourglass shape, give you a little bit more shape, or you can close it completely with the belt. Of course, I have to mention denim jackets. So I have two options to share with you guys. One new, one I've had for years. Um, so this one is new. This one is by Gap. This actually also comes with a belt, which also makes it versatile. You can wear it many different ways. I love this medium wash color. I feel like with denim jackets, it can be tricky finding the right one. I wanted something like a little bit oversized, but not too oversized. And I wanted a denim jacket with a longer length. I love this one. I love, love, love it. I got it in a size extra small. Totally recommend this one. Price point is also fair. I think it's like under $50. And this other denim jacket is what I've had for so many years. This one is cropped. See the length difference? So just depending on what you like, I love both of these. This is more cropped. If you're more into that style, I really like this one. It also comes in petite. However, I didn't purchase this in a petite. I just got this in an extra small. I really like it. And this color is also great, um, but that's the difference between the two. This one is a bit more fitted and cropped. This one has a bit of oversized look and longer. So now let's get into tops. So I actually want to start with this top that I'm wearing because before you click on the link, you guys, I want to give you a big heads up. It is the most stupidly overpriced top in the entire world but i could not keep my eyes off of it i kept going back to it and i just wanted it so bad because i feel like if i was a shirt this is me in a shirt i love the sleeves i love how it's like a knit material here i love the combination of different like textures here um something fun and girly on the sleeves and puffy and you have like little flowers here and then this sweater knit material it's a short sleeve i feel like it's great for the springtime this would look so pretty with medium wash jeans, light wash jeans, white jeans. You can even wear this with skirts. It's just so many possibilities with just a white, girly, dainty top like this that I just love. So it retails for $128. It's so expensive and I wouldn't recommend a top this expensive unless I am like head over heels for it. So I did get this on sale. I got it from Bloomingdale. So I got it for like a right at $100. So better than like $130, $140. Still expensive, but Bloomingdale's does okay occasionally do like 20, 30% off. So if you see it on sale and you really want it, you know, definitely get it on sale. Now I want to recommend just a classic striped 
t-shirt for springtime. I've been getting already so much use out of this one. This is from Mango. I love this boat neck style here. And I got this in a size extra small. This also comes in solid colors like white, black, beige. And I think it's petite friendly because it's not super long. It's not baggy. It's just like a really good fitted t-shirt. I love the quality material. I think it's 100% cotton. So also for spring, I always recommend just a nice quality spring sweater. I got this one from Abercrombie and what I really like about this one is the colors and the thin stripes and how they're spaced out as well. So white and light brown. I feel like you can style this in so many different ways. It's just a really good staple and the weight of this is so nice. The way it just sits and drapes on your body. It looks so flattering, so pretty. I love the crew neck style. It's incredibly comfortable. The length is not super long, so I feel like it's very petite friendly. And again, you can style it in so many different ways. And I feel like having a cami into your spring capsule is also a great option. I got this one from Banana Republic and I got this in an extra small petite. So I love how they have a petite option for camis. It's not super long and then you won't have your bra showing on the side here as well. What I like about this cami, the straps in the front here, they're wider and then they get thinner as it gets higher and then in the back it's thin. It covers your cleavage very well. Um, and I think it also just looks so good if you have a fuller chest size. I wanted to share a lace cami option. Last time I checked, Abercrombie still had this white one in stock. So this first one I shared, definitely more classic, simple. I feel like this is great for work. You can layer a blazer over it. It's gonna look amazing. This one is definitely more feminine because of the lace. And I think it's also a great piece if you wanna make outfits a little bit more feminine. So just depending on your style, I love these two. Something I've had for years is this eyelet top. I love it so much. I wanted to share it in this video. I know I've shared it many times and styled it for you guys several times, but I needed to share it because it's a piece that I pull out every spring and summer. I've been wearing it for years. It's inexpensive. I think it's under $30. I got it from Amazon. I know they still have it. Also comes in tons of other colors. And it's just a really cute girly piece to dress up outfits for the springtime. So you can wear it with denim jeans, you can wear it with a skirt. And I think it's just overall a really cute and feminine piece to add for springtime. And then another one that's also fun, I shared this before already, I've had it for like a couple months now. Uh, it's this square neckline puff sleeve top. Also great if you're petite, because it just hits at the perfect spot with high-waisted jeans. I have it in white and in these dainty floral prints. This also comes in several other colors. Very inexpensive. I actually got this one from Zulily. I love it. I think it's also a really cute, girly piece for springtime. So, you know, I definitely recommend basics for spring, like camis, a striped shirt, a basic sweater. But I also recommend having some fun, girly pieces for tops because you can dress up and play around with outfits for the springtime and just make them a little bit more interesting and just more fun for the springtime. If you're looking for a great white button-up shirt, I definitely recommend checking out H&M. They have so many different styles, so many different fits, just depending on what you're looking for on their site. And I'll try to find one like with this fit. It's a bit oversized. And I like it because it leaves me more room for my chest size. I have a larger chest size than average. And normally how I wear it is I just tuck it into medium wash or light wash denim jeans, wear a nice chic outerwear piece, and I feel like that's a really classic and cute spring outfit. Okay, now let's move into the last category, which is denim jeans. So I have white, medium wash, and light wash jeans that I recommend for the springtime. Personally, those are just the colors that I wear uh, for the springtime. You can definitely put in any other colors that you like. So I'm gonna start with these medium wash. These are actually new. I got these from Abercrombie. These are, they're like curvy, high rise skinny jean in this medium wash color. They have no distressing in them. These kind of remind me of my Topshop Jamie jeans that I recommended so many times. I like these more because the back pockets, I feel like are more flattering, just the way they're placed, how big they are. I feel like they're just, overall very flattering in the back here and they are so petite friendly i got these in a size 23 short and they also come in extra short the short version is a 24 and a half inch inseam so they're a little bit cropped for me which is perfect that's how i like them and also my measurements like waist to hip measurements are not considered curvy however these jeans are curvy but they fit me so if you're curvy or not curvy, I feel like these will still work for you. They just have a little bit more stretch into them and they added like a couple more inches, I think, in the thigh areas. And for white jeans, I got these Madewell 9-inch high-rise jeans. I got these from The Rag. 
hopefully they still have this in stock because I got it for a really good deal but I'll also link this pair from Nordstrom and from Madewell um, really good classic white denim jean they're skinny jean they come in a 26 and a half inch inseam so to me that's a petite friendly length that's a full length jean for me however I did cut these because I do like my jeans cropped um, so I can expose more ankle. That's just my personal preference But if you purchase them as is they are petite friendly length for a skinny light wash jean I love these from Levi's. They're the 501 skinny jeans These have a more relaxed fit for a skinny jean So if you want them a little bit tighter go down a size I'm wearing them in a 24 if I went to a 23 They would have been a little bit more skinnier on me, but they do stretch as you wear them just FYI so they have a more relaxed look to them the more you wear them. And I did cut these jeans because they weren't really petite friendly. They're 28 inch inseam, so for some petites it would work, but for me being extra short, it didn't. But I did cut them and I like how they look. And I also wanted to recommend a light wash straight jean because I know a lot of girls love to wear straight jeans. These Madewell ones are my favorite. These are their perfect vintage jean in light wash. These are in a petite, I believe they're like a 26 and a half inch inseam. So they're a full length jean on me. Love wearing these. They are so flattering, so stunning, really good petite denim jean for like a straight jean style. And you don't have to do any like hemming or adjusting to them. They come perfect. Love this color. They also come in other colors. These are definitely more of a splurge, but I definitely recommend them because they are so flattering and you can wear them in so many different ways. All right, you guys, that brings it to the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed seeing all these pieces for my spring capsule wardrobe for 2022. As always, everything is going to be linked down below if you wanted to check anything out. And again, my next video that's coming out is going to be spring dresses. So I'm gonna have this clothing rack filled with lots of different dresses for the spring and summertime for you guys, which I'm very excited about. So if you're new, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more videos. Like this video if you enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!